Obi-Wan, what's with the sour face? It's supposed to be a clear day out today. Good weather. You're starting this conversation with weather talk. Really? Is this what we've stooped to? You know, I'm just saying stuff. Nice sunglasses, Master Kenobi. Ugh, thanks, Ahsoka. I thought you said Ahsoka lost the bet last time and you wouldn't wear them. Well, I'm a softy, and I agreed to wear them for the first minute. He's too scared to let the guests see it. Whatever. What else have you got for us today? Anyone got a joke or something? I've got a funny joke, guys. What do you get when you cross a Jedi with a comedian? Comedy is supposed to be my thing, so the answer is clearly a laugh saber. Uh, no. You get a forced sense of humor? As usual, Anakin is making no sense. It makes sense, Master. You're just too old to get it. A simple good joke, Ahsoka, would be nice. Good joke, Ahsoka. Mine was better. The hell it was. I'm sick of letting you get away with being so insufferably unfunny. I'm sick of you being so insufferably ugly. You wouldn't know what insufferably ugly means if it hit you in the face, which it did, because you're ugly. Relax, guys. Why are you at each other's throats today? You don't want this smoke, old man. You're just a washed-up pod racer. And you're just a diversity promotion. The hell does that mean? It means you're the only white man on the council. That can't be right. What about Kiadi Mundi? He's a penis head. Yarael Poof? He's a queer man. He's a Quermian, Anakin. So, same thing. What about Windu? He's a human, too. Yeah, but he's a All right, I get your point. But the council is meant to be diverse. And you fit the bill. You're so annoying. I think you're the one who's annoying, old man. You can't stop screwing up our missions. Your mind is too focused on whether you want to plow Cody or Satine first. Oh, and you're such a brilliant tactician yourself. You, who can't help himself from grabbing Sith Lords as a guest in every damn episode. You know what, Anakin? Perhaps we should try your methods. Uh, now hold on, Master. I don't think that- That's your problem. You don't think. So let's do what Anakin would do. Let's not think. But I'm the only one who's good at not thinking. Guys, we should think this through. This one should work. Interesting lightsaber and all. Whoa, what the hell? I was just about to be my new training room on record. Oh, sure. Don't listen to me. I'm just the Padawan. I agree with Ahsoka, Master. Ooh, I don't think this is a good idea. You don't have the best taste in guests. Deal with it, Anakin. This time it was my decision. D did you say Anakin? Wait, no, that can't be. Your grandpa be? Yo, I've been dying to meet you. Yes, I'm so excited. Yes, yes, yes. Uh, is this dude like 14? Oh, I'm so excited. Granddaddy, please, you must tell me all about your... Buddy, what are you talking about? Grand? I'm not old enough to be a grandpa. You do realize this was time travel, right? He's not a dumbass, you stupid orange. He's a super genius. Okay, I kind of like this guy, actually. Ugh, how come I keep grabbing motherfucking Skywalkers in every portal? I don't know, but I'm getting kind of sick of it. What's up, people? It's your boy, Kylo Ren. This isn't part of the video. I'm just telling you that you should go support Zenger on Patreon. He's a pretty cool dude, and he offers some stuff. Also, the more people who support him, the more videos he can make. Anyway, back to the video. What have I done? Don't say that, Master. He seems like a cool guy so far. I'm so excited to meet Darth Vader. In the flesh. Even though I can't see his face, I'm sensing that he's really hot. Please, Ahsoka, can you go one episode without being thirsty? It's getting old and unfunny. I'll stop being horny when you stop being meta. It's an honor to meet you. So I guess I'm not the only one who became a Sith, huh? Ew, I'm not some cringe Sith. That's so BBY. Nah, I'm like a really evil dude. Yeah, you're, uh, really striking me with fear. Good, that's what I do. The name Kylo Ren strikes fear into my enemies' hearts. You sound like a dude with daddy issues. What? Why would, why would you... Why, why would you say that? I don't have daddy issues. Oh yeah, you hear that. Denial. It's the first sign. I don't have daddy issues. I killed my lame dad. I solved any issues. Daddy issues, huh? Yeah, I could work with that. Who are you? Ahsoka Tano, your granddad's Padawan. Ahsoka, maybe Anakin's family should be off limits for you. I'll be the judge of that. So, I'm your grandpa? Which one of my kids got laid? I just hope Kylo isn't an incest baby. It was probably Luke. You know what? On second thought, nah, it couldn't have been him. He was a bit of a, a white bitch. Yeah, I feel that. My mom was Leo Organa. At least she was somewhat dignified. Unlike my uncle. My father. 
Well, you don't seem to have picked up on a peculiar taste for Anakin. Hey, aren't you the ass-shaving video guy? Oh, not this again. That's old news, Kylo. No, seriously, it's like uncanny. Let me see your ass. I could confirm it. Wait, better yet, can you sign my ass? I mean, help shave it just like you did in the video. It was hilarious. He was totally into it, though. Uh, okay. What? I don't know who Hux is, but he sounds like a loser for real. Oh, yeah, he is. Hux is one hell of a beta cuck. It may or not have been my ass that was shaving that day. You'll just never know. I think we already know, Master. I mean, Rex even tried to show me the video last week. I mean, when I said Cody got in there, I mean, like, he got way in there. Like, I didn't know a razor could go that far. Gross. I don't want to hear about that, Anakin. Yes, not exactly a family-friendly topic. What were we saying about Kylo's mom being your daughter? I'm kind of surprised you seem chill with me, Kylo, considering Leia just hurled slurs at me the entire time we spoke. My mom had this idea that Granddaddy was, like, a loser or something. Just because he killed a few kids? They have really over-exaggerated that shit. I don't know how to feel about being called Granddaddy. Is it wrong that it's making me a little hard? Shut up, Anakin! For the love of Lucas, you seem more unhinged than Anakin somehow. Who would have thought that was possible? For real, man. I totally killed some kids myself. When the Knights of Ren and I raided Uncle Luke's temple, I made sure to personally kill all the kids myself. Something about it just made me feel so alive. Dude, can you be any more unstable? You got a problem, girly? Yeah, I mean, at first I was kinda into you, but the more you speak, the more I get turned off. Yeah, I don't give a crap. I'm not into orange skin colors. Is that racist? Yes. No! Hey, how is that not racist? Because it's true, obviously. He's got you there. Besides, I've totally got a girlfriend already. At least I think we're dating. Or at least, at least she's like totally into me. You sound a little unsure about that, Kylo. We have some random FaceTime calls in the middle of the night, so it's basically official. Have you told her about sand yet? No. Should I? Is that a good way to riz up chicks? I mean, it worked for me. Cool. Tell me about how you snagged Grandma. I've seen photos, and she was a snack for real. Oh great, you're into incest too. You would be too if everyone in your family was like a 10 out of 10. Yeah, I don't think I would be. Anakin, you might want to think about not reproducing. This is getting worse in every generation. Too late, Master. I've already got Padme pregnant. Tell me all about that, Grandpappy. Dude, stop saying that. Make me, bitch. Whoa, Kylo, relax with that. Don't call Ahsoka that word. She's like a little sister to me. So she's like my grand aunt? Hmm. I guess she is kind of hot. I'm 17, dude. You know what they say. Off the clock. Ready for the cock. All right, that's enough. Tell me more about this girl you're seeing, Kylo. I'd like to know more about my future step-granddaughter. Oh, she's mean. Like, she'll, like, yell at me and call me a monster and shit. I just tell her to keep going and going. And man, she does a great job. Makes me feel like a real man. There's something horribly wrong with you. I'm a Skywalker. Obviously, there's something wrong with me. But, like, you like women being mean to you? You're sounding like a simp, bro. A simp? Maybe, but nah, besides her having, like, some divine feet, I wouldn't be down for that. She's cute, but I ain't about to fall for an eager old side up. Uh, are we glossing over the feet thing? Yeah, that's actually pretty normal. What's an e-girl psyop? You know, like, when they put, like, ads of an above-average woman enlisted in the army or whatever and trick thirsty dudes into signing up, thinking they'll get some sweet soldier puss. That definitely works the other way around, too. I remember begging Master Yoda to let me in the Clone Wars because those clones were fine as hell. You, Ahsoka, don't say that. I thought you wanted to be a Jedi. Sure. I totally wanted to be caught in a war and risk my life for no fucking reason. No, you idiot. I was in it for the clone trooper abs. Same, to be honest. I didn't realize clone troopers were so attractive. I don't really get it. They're just dudes. You sound a bit jealous, Anakin. I'm not jealous. I'm just confused why you bring this up all the time. Technically, I brought it up. You're no better, especially lately. You gotta work on some stuff, Snips. Me? You're the one with the absolutely unhinged family dynamic. Speaking of which, you should probably get rid of him. Hey, Grandpa. Can you cut off my arm? Look for a thing to remember you by? Uh... 
What? That came out of nowhere. You know, like, I know you got an arm cut off, and Luke got an arm cut off. I figure if I'm gonna be the next Skywalker kid, I should have that too. It ain't really all it's cut out to be, kid. Turns out magnets are just as big an enemy as sand. Maybe you should swing for his arm, but miss and cut him at his neck. Settle down there, Snips. Kylo is a chill dude, right? Uh, he's made sexual comments toward me and insulted me to your face. You've done worse to Master Windu for a lot less. Yeah, but I wanted to kill him. He was kind of pissing me off. Kylo here is a real G. Don't be surprised, Ahsoka. Anakin is wildly inconsistent in his day-to-day -day characteristics. This is pissing me off, though. This Kylo guy is so weird. You know what? I'm ending this now. What are you gonna do? Stab me? Maybe. I'd like to see you try. Maybe I will. <laughs> I'm a Skywalker girl. You think you can challenge me? You don't want to see what I can do with this thing. You're just a kid in a ski mask. You're not even a Sith, just some loser with a broken lightsaber. Hey, take that back! My lightsaber's cool! Looks like a child made it. Couldn't even get the stability right. It's an intentional fashion choice! I think it's cool, Kylo. <laughs> Thanks, Grandpappy. You're the coolest. Ugh, just get out of here. If you kill her, I'll give you a cookie. Hey, wait, what? I need that cookie. Come here, bitch. Anakin, what the hell? What? Why would you ask him to kill me? What did I do to you? Oh, please. You handled him just fine. As you said, he was just some loser kid in a ski mask. I knew you'd beat him. Oh, so it was just an excuse for me? Ahsoka, you're a lot of things, but I knew you weren't gonna strike down the kid unless it was self-defense, even if he was egging you on. So, yeah, I gave him an incentive. I don't know why he got so excited for the cookie. I took a guess that he knew what those dark side cookies taste like. Who one day, Anakin? One day. Well, I'm glad that's over with. I'm reevaluating my taste in men from here on out. There we go, Roger. You're all better now. Please be gentle this time. I'm sorry I was so mean to you earlier, Master. You know I love you. I tolerate you too. Special thanks to Carter L, CDX, Fudge Cake, Lionel Barina, Plus Gear, Red Sith Master, Thestral Pony, and Vasu Patel for your generous help by being an insane patron. Comment down below who you think the next guest should be. We'll see you soon.